Okay, we're at the farmer's market. Ah, uh, we came a long way since I landed in this city about 16 years ago. I remember there was so many cars. I was living in a tent in front of the legislator protesting against Ritlin. I had a big petition going on. And then I asked, uh, what's all these cars? They said the farmer's market. Farmer's market? What's that? So, uh, next thing you know, I was across the street. I remember I met the manager, told me I was collecting names at the main entrance. Then they told me to go across the street. Evelyn. And manager's gone. She wrote a book, she, uh, and then she, I was mentioned in a chapter. Then there was Charles LeBlanc. Charles LeBlanc, the snobs. Snob, snobs. I'd like to know, really, if they really, really, the people realize who helped start the farmer's market. Sure, it was the farmers a long time ago. I wasn't even born. But, to have a business, is this going on? Yeah. If you, am I boring you? To have a business, you need the support. And the support, they're called vendors. Vendors is very important to run a farmer's market. They're, they dedicate themselves to come here every week. They get up at four or five o'clock in the morning, winter, summer, it don't matter if it's cold, wet, they come here, they pay their fees, and they are dedicated to the farmer's market. Now, the province gave the city the farmer's market for them to run it. Well, mistake. No use to touch that idiot mayor, Michael Bryan, because it doesn't matter. He doesn't do anything anyway. All he does is run. Um, they took a person that's been there for, what was it, 14 years, selling handcraft stuff from Durham Bridge, come here, no problem, they had two boots, one for knitting, the other one for his work, they always paid their fees, no problem. The next day you know, the board of directors, the board of directors said, nope, you, you're gonna go there and you wanna sell your knitting stuff, no problem, use the wall in the back. And the wall in the back is a window. So, and this is orders from the board of directors of the boys market, boys, boys mar farmers market. I'm tired, I can't even speak. I could never speak anyway. Yeah, really, you're really fucking asleep. The board of directors told that vendor they're making a mockery out of him, making fun. <laughs> uh, use the window, use the wall behind you, and there's not even a wall. That's the thanks they give to the long-term vendors been here for a long time. Maybe I'm being distracted by that siren. I didn't even talk right. So my question is this. Who's on the board of director of the farmer's market? Who's on the board? They're supposed to sell cranberry juice, I think. To make a mockery, you're gonna lose a boot. And then they put the, the person right beside the guy that's been there for 14 years. I mean, they're forcing the guy out. So what's going on at the farmer's market? Who is on the board of directors? That's what I wanna know. Wanna go for a walk? Come on, let's go.